In the heart of the vast and unpredictable oceans, nature orchestrates a symphony of power and chaos. A symphony that begins with a whisper, a mere gust of wind, and escalates into a deafening roar that can shape the fate of coastlines and communities. What you are about to witness is the birth of a behemoth, a force of nature so immense, it can tear apart landscapes and reshape the very contours of our world. This is the story of how hurricanes are formed, a tale of warm waters, atmospheric intrigue, and raw, unrelenting power. From humble beginnings, a hurricane emerges. It begins as a collection of clouds, drifting innocently over the open sea. But within these clouds lies the potential for devastation, a potential waiting to be awakened. Hurricanes are born over warm ocean waters. The sun's fiery embrace and heats the ocean's surface. Typically when the sea surface temperature reaches around 26.5 degrees Celsius, 80 degrees Fahrenheit, or higher. Warm ocean water provides the necessary energy for the storm to develop and intensify. This causes water vapor to rise into the atmosphere, carrying with it the energy that fuels the storm. As moist air ascends, it cools and condenses, forming towering clouds pregnant with electric charge. A tempestuous dance begins, a battle between hot and cold. A clash of pressures, a maelstrom of forces. One crucial ingredient for hurricane formation is the Coriolis effect, which is caused by the Earth's rotation. This effect causes the developing storm to start spinning and taking on a rotating, circular shape, breathing life into what was once a mere disturbance. As the warm, moist air continues to rise, it creates an area of low pressure at the surface. Air from the surrounding areas rushes in to fill this void, setting up a cycle of converging and rising air. With each passing moment, the storm gains strength, its swirling core a cauldron of rising heat and spiraling fury. A deceptive calm envelopes the center of the hurricane, this calm and clear area known as the eye starts to form. Surrounding the eye is the eye wall, which contains the strongest winds and heaviest rainfall. Spiral rain bands extend outward from the eye wall. The eye wall is where the most intense convection occurs, with air rising rapidly and releasing tremendous amounts of energy. This energy release is what powers the hurricane's winds and intensifies the storm. Causing ferocious ring of clouds and thunderstorms. What you see is not just wind and rain. It's a testament to the Earth's mightiest forces at play. The movement of a hurricane is influenced by high-altitude winds, known as steering currents. These winds help determine the direction a hurricane will take, whether it will make landfall,
or remain over the open ocean. When a hurricane moves over land or colder waters, it loses its source of warm, moist air and begins to weaken. The friction from the land also slows down the storm's winds. Eventually, the storm dissipates as it loses its energy. In conclusion, the formation of a hurricane is a complex process driven by the combination of warm ocean waters, evaporation, condensation, the Coriolis effect, and atmospheric conditions. Understanding these factors can help us better predict and prepare for these powerful natural events. It's a reminder of our vulnerability in the face of nature's unyielding temper. When a hurricane sets its sights on land, there's no time to waste. Preparation becomes your shield against its fury, and planning can mean the difference between safety and chaos. Assemble an emergency kit. Fill it with non-perishable food, water, medications, important documents, flashlights, batteries, and a first aid kit. Imagine it as your lifeline when the world goes dark. Create an evacuation plan. Gather your loved ones and map out a clear route to safety. Identify shelters and establish a communication plan so that, even in the chaos, you can stay connected. Safeguard your home. Board up windows and clear your yard of loose objects. Trim trees and shrubs to reduce potential flying debris. A few hours of preparation can save a lifetime of regrets. Stay informed. Keep an eye on the weather forecasts and updates from local authorities. Technology has armed us with the power of knowledge, so use it to your advantage. Community Unity Reach out to your neighbors, especially the elderly or those with special needs. A helping hand can turn a time of crisis into a display of strength and support. Hunker down. When the storm arrives, stay indoors away from windows. Keep your emergency kit and a supply of water close. And remember, during power outages, candles should be used cautiously to prevent accidents. And finally, when the tempest has passed, Take a moment to appreciate your preparedness. You've not only protected yourself, but ensured that you can stand strong in the face of nature's fury. Because in a world where the unexpected can strike, your readiness can make all the difference.